welcome hello we are in the middle of well we're not in the middle we're just at the beginning aren't we woohoo <laughs> of our egyptian priest uh, priest and priestess lineage clearing for those um uh, lovely beings who want to uh, really embrace their healerness and so this is our 11 11 so welcome we are here in avalon i'm daisy foss and Paul, uh, my wonderful husband, um, w is introducing us through the music and seems to have disappeared though, so <laughs> I'm sure he'll come back in a second. Um, and so this is exciting. It's uh, the 23rd of September. It's the day after the equinox. Goodness gracious me, what an uh, experience yesterday was. It, the energies literally were up and down, in and out. And so uh, here um, in, in uh, the Daisy Center, we have had a few revelations. And the revelation that uh, uh, I've come to is that the, um, do you want to play a bit more sound? Um, the revelation is that this is exactly six months since we started to uh, transmit our 11 minutes past 11 every day so it's six months daily we if we haven't uh, if i haven't been here in person paul and i then we have been uh, um, showing you the altar with the music that's lovely thank you lovely <laughs> i ask him that's beautiful thank you if you play at the end as well Thank you. <laughs> and as you've noticed, we are completely in the moment. We are completely unprofessional at this, although we professionally are be, have been doing it for six months. We've loved every minute of it and we are going to take a rest. This is the, um, the we were told by the angels it would be the 22nd of the 9th, 2020, which was yesterday. The, uh, their exact words were at the end of the autumn equinox. And of course, the energy for that flows through for two days either side. So we are going to give you notice that we will um, be resting for a spiritual maintenance from tomorrow. So tomorrow will be the very last live Facebook for a while. Um, we'll come back in a different form, probably um, uh, once or twice a week. I don't know yet. We've got to sit and really be with the angels. But all of the old ones are on our YouTube channel. Um, and so we would be very happy for you to, to look at those. Um, we'll still continue with the 1111 motivational messages and we will still bring in the energy of the daisy centers occasionally but the lives um, for the next few weeks um, probably till the, f the next new moon will not be me sitting in front of the camera every day um, so uh, just giving you notice and so tomorrow will be the last one for a while but today we are in the middle of this egyptian workshop so um, I really want to bring through the Egyptian energies. We've got Isis here, the Ankh. We have all the crystals that really started this. These are the Egyptian um, uh, calcite from Telelamana and the, uh, the touch for health, the fingers and the wings, these beautiful crystals. I'm going to beam them out to you right now. So beaming from the heart of Avalon, from the angels of Avalon, from the angels of Atlantis, the crystal angels, we're going to bring you this healing energy for you to receive this light. And as the calcites, we're bringing that energy through. I'm going to bring the first crystal I ever bought, this apophyllite, bringing the energy of the Atlantean angels. This is Tanzaniel, is the tourmaline and the Apophyllite is Esmeriel, these Atlantean uh, angels from the angels of Atlantis. So close your eyes, take a big deep breath in. And as you breathe in this light, we bless the angels, we thank them for everything that they have been doing for us. 
We bless them. We thank them for all the healing that has been uh, with us daily. We bless, we thank them for sending this light out around the world through the ley lines, through the micro lines, through the synchronic lines, right through the galactic ley lines. We have had so much help from the angels, from Atlantis, from the Avalon, from the Angles, from Ascension, all these angels bringing their light in through the stars and the planets and all of the angelic realms have been rep represented here. And as we bless and we thank Merlin, Merlin who has brought his magic m through me, Daisy, Merlina, this beautiful light just flowing and overflowing through your being as we bring the energy of the of the aquamarine, this beautiful light, bringing it through from Merlin and Merlina, this beautiful energy, transforming, transmuting, returning to source, anything that is less than love, any feelings of frustration, any feelings of fear, any feelings of despair, any feelings of confusion, of anger, Anything that is not helping you and is blocking your, your ascension, just let it go. Let it go, let it go. And as you let it go, the energy can flow through from the top of your head to the tip of your toes. As it flows through your crown chakra, this beautiful thousand petaled crown flower at your top of your head, your crown, as it flows through your heart, 144 petals of your heart, as it flows through your sacral chakra, once again, 144 petals at your sacral chakra, through to your root chakra, through to the earth. And as your root chakra connects fully with the earth, anchoring and grounding you, and as this light fills your being, you are safe. The angels are all around you. Even if you can't see them, you don't believe that they're there. Just know that they are there. Know and trust that the angels will always be there. You just have to invite them. They, they sit otherwise with flat noses against the window. She won't let me in. He won't let me in. And so let your angels in. Just feel the energy. Hold out your hands, open your heart, and as you feel this energy, just trust that this energy is yours. And as you trust that this energy flowing now through from the great central sun, through your light channel to the pearl of your heart, this beautiful space in the center of your being, the pearl of your heart, the pearl of your wisdom, beaming out this light, beaming out this love. And as it beams this light and love, this love light, breathes the one breath of creation. It's your life to create. Be creative. Be so in alignment with how you feel how you choose to be and as you breathe in this light of creation breathing the light of the universe this universal light with the flame of golden love as this golden light just fills your being from the tip of your toes to the top of your head and as it fills this space and place of love, just feel the smile within your heart. Feel the smile of gratitude, of joy. Feel the smile as the smile expands through every cell of your body, like a pebble in the pond. Through the pearl of your heart, this smile expands expanding through all of the cells of your organs, through all of the cells of your systems, your immune system. This smile is just flowing through your whole being, 
through your chakras, a beautiful big smile in all of your chakras. And as this smile expands through all of your bodies, bless you. <laughs> through your physical body, through your emotional body, your mental body, your karmic body, through all your bodies, your spiritual body, this smile from the angels, this smile from your heart. And as this smile just flows and overflows, feel the joy, feel the blessings, feel the thanks. We have loved doing this. So until tomorrow, we are just bringing in this light, open hearts, open hands, the sounds of the harmony from Paul, Paul Foss, the cosmic percussionist. Rebecca's been here daily doing this for us as well. Blessings. We have Murray here too and a whole room full. Well, not a whole room, six people. <laughs> Just radiating this light, this love. So from the heart of Avalon, from the Daisy Centre, from me, from my heart to yours, as the energy starts to flow through, as the autumn equinox starts to wane, we're going into a new cycle, a new now. It's all very exciting as we refresh, realign, renew. So from my heart to yours, this wonderful, big, angelic, etheric hug as we bless and we thank you for watching. Lots and lots of love. Namaste.